event here in the Telangana region. Of course, they voted simultaneously for both the Assembly and Lok Sabha elections. We are calling it historic elections. But if the people of Telangana or Hyderabad were anxious, they didn't seem to show it in the voting percentages. They were hardly about 70% today polling re registered in the Telangana region. But what has marked out this election is the very high spending by the different political players. Even today, in fact, a car was seized with about 2 crore estimated cash stacked away inside the engine and the way it was found out was because the cash actually burnt because of the heat in the engine and that's how it was found out. This car belonged apparently to, an, uh, uh, to a sitting MLA, a candidate from one of the constituencies, a Congress candidate and he is also the working president of the uh, of, uh, PCC here in the Telangana region. Burnt remains of wads of cash hidden inside the engine and bonnet of a vehicle bearing the sticker of sitting MLA of Huzur Nagar and Congress candidate Uttam Kumar Reddy. The car was travelling from Surya Pay to Huzur Nagar this afternoon when the currency caught fire. The driver and others fled the scene. Andhra Pradesh has reported the highest cash seizures anywhere in the country this election season, accounting for over 127 crore rupees out of 240 crore rupees all over the country. Actually, it's a burnt one. Only few uh, sort of bundles are uh, just visible. Others are burnt out. So, allegations are about two and a half crores. But um, it's very difficult to exactly ascertain how much was the money unless uh, the case is investigated. Today, if you see, uh, Congress MLA's uh, money, Uttam Kumar Reddy's money, was actually burning his car. But you will also have seen huge money. So, that's it's, uh, in India, one of the highest spending is happening in the state of Andhra Pradesh. And I just hope and appeal to Election Commission to actually take appropriate action. The flow of liquor and money has been unprecedented, so much so that political observers say as much as 120 crore rupees may have been spent in a Lok Sabha segment and as much as 20 to 30 crore rupees in an assembly seat. If that is an indication of the kind of governments that will take over, both Telangana and Andhra Pradesh have reason to worry. In Hyderabad with camera person Nagaraju Umar Sudhir, NDTV.